Hey YouTube, it's been a while. Uh, unfortunately, I uh, stumbled into some legal problems. And uh, let's just say it's been some hard times once again. But uh, let's just say I haven't uh, given up the, the good fight. And I'm actually down here at the park. I have to finish up by seven or that's when I have curfew now. And uh, I'm down here practicing, uh, you know, firearm tactics. I got a Desert Eagle. As you can see, it's an airsoft gun because unfortunately, I can't own a firearm until I sort some stuff out. And here is my uh, combatant. Think of this as an Osama Bin Laden. That's right, still a good shot. The court system and Obama can't take that away from me. But my favorite thing to do with the Deagle is to get in close. Pretend this was uh, Osama Bin Laden. What are you doing here, terrorist? Deagle. Very strong weapon. A lot of power behind it. That's what I do. Chris Kyle style. pretty uh, prideful for me to uh, come down here and basically just, you know, I'm not allowed to own firearms, but uh, that doesn't mean I can't get my combat training. <sighs> what the hell was that? Oh shit, you gotta be kidding me. <sighs> Whoa. <sighs> what was that? Could it be a mermaid? Jesus Christ, I might kill the first mermaid ever on tape. This glorious all-American weapon, the Desert Eagle. You mermaid fuck. That was clearly a mermaid hiss, I know that for a fact. Did I get it? Might have escaped. All this combat training, Semper Fidelis. And yet, like Chris Kyle, well I should say more like Chris Kyle's friend, who blasted him away. I missed the shot that really counts. I was finally about to uh, secure my place in military history on my return to civ life. But instead, like Chris Kyle, I was shot down by post-traumatic stress. <sighs> to think I could have killed a real mermaid on tape. If I still allowed to own a firearm,